Hi guys, it's me, Debbie, which you already know. Anyways, guys, I want to be doing, um, I'm going to, I'm drawing a palm tree. I have a tray that I want to see if I could get a decorated. And I want to see if I do a ocean thing. Um, if the work comes out wrong, I apologize. A beachy thing. So... I'm drawing a palm tree. Doesn't look like a palm tree right now, but I'm going to be using marker. But right now, I'm doing my pencil. And I also have some paint here that I'm gonna be using. So, I started, this is how I started my palm tree. It looks like a regular tree, but it's gonna be a palm tree. You guys gonna see all finished. It's gonna have different color greens. And of course, this is have to be finished on the bottom. And hopefully I don't do this video. I set up the camera. I finally figured out how to set up the camera with YouTube that I could pause and keep recording. So guys, I'll be right back. Hey guys, I'm back. I'm going to tilt you guys down because I want you to see what, how I'm getting the, like the ridges to the, give the like, leaves some definition. I'm using a cardboard and you know how the cardboard has those little, um, the double cardboard and it actually has like, you see, I see the little lines there. So I'm using that to give the leaves definition. So let me show you. I'm using a crayon. So let me tilt you guys down. So I, have, I hope everybody's doing well. So, oh, I finished my palm tree, palm tree. So, and since I drew lines, let me show you guys. Since I drew lines and I drew a couple of coconuts, I'm not done with the coconut, but I drew some lines in it with the pencil. So I'm putting it in a, in top of the cardboard to make believe the you know, that's how I made the line. So I'm actually using a crayon and I'll show you. Oh, I'll show you like that. They actually look like pine, pine leaf, palm leaves. It's hard for me to say this. In Spanish, it's called a palma. So That's a trick if you want to learn know how to use this the crayon and um, use the a cardboard for your background. It will give you that illusion. The that's how you just draw all the lines, which is very simple to do. I will do one right quick. It doesn't take too long, so you guys gonna see. So, you guys see, you guys see the lines. So, let me turn it around to give another. I mean, they look like it looks like a bluish type of green, but that's fine by me because I'm gonna go over it with very um, diluted. Um, water with a little bit of green in it and it won't give that illusion so turn keep turning the paper like that you have the lines going different ways I know there's going on out there, there is like a challenge or a DIY challenge or a custard theme, but I'm just bored. I don't have nothing to do. And since I don't know how to link channels, um, I'm just doing my own thing and I would just post it. So I do not know who the hosters are. Now that I cannot go and subscribe, but. Uh, I already started the video and I will have to stop my video to go and check out um, the channels because I don't remember the hostess names. So now I'm going to take 
um, I don't have a brown one, so, but I do have, I don't know what this thing is called, uh, I don't know. So I'm going to um, use this to give definition to the, in the middle right here. Because, you know, the pantry, the leaf doesn't come straight from the thing. They have like a stem. And then you get that long leaf. So. Okay. So. I also have a green pencil. So. I'm just going to go with the leaves. So I'll be right back. Okay, I'm going to do one leaf right quick here. Like that, you guys, I'm going to fill up a spot. So. Fill up a line in the middle. Then just take your pencil, a couple of lines like this. And then a couple of lines the other way. And you have the leaf. Here, I'm going to fill up this one. This one. This one. Now, I do have a marker here. Need some dark lines here just to fill up. Not every part leaf, if you live in Puerto Rico or in Florida, you know that not all their leaves are perfectly so. guys that's that I'm gonna take the crayon and go over fill up those empty spots I don't want no white in it so Right, that's my leaves that's my pants so some leaves are greener I mean I see like it has more green in so but than others so let me take the marker and go here give her some balance um, up here guys I'm gonna post you guys right there now I'm gonna do the stem I'm gonna color it and I'll be right back well now I'm drawing I'm going back here on the bottom you guys can see I'm doing some sand which is very simple to do So now I'm going to use this color And also, I'm going to use the pencil. Actually, you know what? I'm going to use the yellow one. I'm 
I miss Annie's Nayelo. It depends where you are, but you guys see what I'm going to do because I'm going to use the gray pencil. Now take your finger and then you could repeat that process. I don't have gray so but anyways to give you guys an idea so now I'm going to uh, map hash it here and then I'm gonna cut it all up I'll be right back guys here it is I'll cut up now it's time to map posh I'll be right back well guys I did it I glued it on the um, I mean I could have used that part for the pantry but it has little um, squares and stuff so i glued it i cut it all up now it's time to decorate let's go well guys i'm back with the end of the video and this is what it looks like that's how i put it all together i'll show you guys from the top that's the pantry that, that i just diy of course, that's something that my niece gifted to me that she actually painted herself. Um, and these are my dolphins. This is, I, they all drifted, but this one was the first one. Then this one I got uh, about when the Google opened, I think it was about three weeks or four weeks ago. And then this one is the one that I told you guys that I got last in uh, rugs. And of course, um, these, um, what do you call it? Sound dollars was um, also my niece gifted to me. And that's a candle. That's what that I got the idea from. And that's a drift candle that I got for like two years now. And it's, it's the first time that I turn it on. So I'm going to turn off the light, guys. And this is what it looks like. I hope you guys like it. And this is my DIY of a beach theme. Oh, and by the way, I don't know if you guys can see from there. Um, this right here is a little trinket box from my collection with a little fish in it. And this is all the stuff that I have that I own that is a beach theme. Guys, remember, be kind on one to another, but kind. be kind to one another. Don't forget to smile. And remember, things can always get worse, but if you prevent it, it will not get worse. Love you guys. Into the next one. Bye.